word that captures the excitement of televised sports at the mere turn of a dial. But to television crews, it means hours of pre-game preparation to reach that satellite floating thousands of miles above your living room. It's midday down in the Big O's underground, nearly eight hours before home meets visitors on television screens across the country. Step right up into baseball's mobile TV studio. Open our mics upstairs. We're on, you guys. It's a tiny room with a view where they monitor the game, follow every nuance, guess the next move. It may lack elbow room, but it doesn't cramp their style. Meet the producer and director of Labatt Expo's Baseball. My right-hand man is actually the producer of the show. Uh, he's my right-hand man. In other words, Brian's the storyteller and Jim's the traffic cop. Together, with a crew of 30, they bring you the game, cleverly packaged, to keep you tuned in. Uh, I look at myself as the, the third manager of the ball teams. I'm, the, I'm in charge of the third team. Now I watch what they do and try and react to what they're doing on the field to make sure that the viewer at home gets uh, the same feeling as the people in the ballpark do. Compare it to a football game. Whereas the producer is like the head coach. He prepares a game plan for the game. And the director, I guess, would be the quarterback who has to execute that game plan to the best way of his capabilities with the cameras and the pictures that he has on hand. But unlike the fans in the stands and the viewers at home, the veterans of televised baseball see the game from an entirely different vantage point. Baseball is an unfolding series of 162 soap opera issues. So I try to build storylines. What, who's mad at who, who's not talking to who, who's in whose doghouse, uh, who's playing with who, etc who's doing well, who's not doing well, and try and capture that for the viewer and give, give the viewer that kind of an impression with the telecast. The difference between the, a live sports event and a taped um, variety show, let's say, is in sports, you, we don't dictate what they do. They dictate to us. The baseball game is not a series of disjointed innings. I mean, there is a, there is a flow to it. And sometimes you have to change the flow in the middle of the game because the game dictates what you want to do. You never know what's going to happen. You might think you know what's going to happen, but it never does. But that's the great thing about the game is it's so unpredictable that you really never know what's going to happen until the final out. So you have to react instantly to what the managers and the players have uh, done to you and uh, make it work, make the viewer see everything. From control room to camera, from home plate to home plate. Live coverage brings home another ball game where each player's a character, each innings a chapter, a mini-series of the major leagues. It is live and creative and you have no time for error and you make mistakes, obviously. Everybody does, but when everything works, there's just no feeling like it. Live is a feeling uh, inside your heart, your stomach, and your, your head, and it all comes together. What it means to me is it is uh, the most exciting part of this business. For Expo Summer 88, I'm Lou Hennessian.